Hey guys, how are you today? We are here for another episode of Explorations of Me uh, for September 2019. And we're here to just talk about, are you aware of who you surround yourself with? Um, the people that you surround yourself with? Are they uplifting and positive people or not? And if they're not, um, helpful and uplifting and positive, then um, I question why you put yourself in that position. Life is tough enough, especially with any kind of chronic physical or mental health issues. We don't need people who aren't at least trying to help us out and give us a hand. Um, it's just, it's tough enough. You don't need that. Um, it's really easy to dwell on the negative. We don't need help with that. If you're like me, you definitely don't need help with that. Um, I need somebody to remind me everything's going to be okay. Um, nine times out of 10. If you don't believe me, ask my friend Cindy Etter or Vicki Brown or Peg Robinson or uh, Leslie McGrath or Carla McCants because yeah, I've verbally, mentally vomited all over them about whatever's stressing me out more than once. So Anyway, we're going to work through our thoughts on the subject today about who we surround ourselves with and why. And I have this image uh, before I was even sure of the subject matter today that I think I want to use on my journal page um, that I found in a magazine recently. And I have this two page spread that I just randomly put scraps of paper on. We've got this one thing tucked here, which is fine. Um, yeah, I may use it the way it is. I may cover it up. I might take it off. I might do something like that. I'm not exactly sure yet. I also have some stencils that uh, my friend Jeff Utter has designed for his wife, Cindy. I don't think they're publicly available yet. These are uh, prototypes and they're not all, this one still has some of the stencil waste in it. So I think we're gonna um, use some of these in the background. Um, these are some of the ones with more positive affirmations in them, like be patient, be kind, take your time, stop beating yourself up, you can do this, it's okay to rest. Um, and then there's a couple of random images here. So they're pretty cool. So I'm going to um, use those in the background and I'm not sure exactly where this is gonna take me, but while I'm doing it, I want you all to think about who you surround yourself with and are they positive and uplifting? Do they help you move forward or do they keep you mired in the negative and in the past? Because that's not helpful for anybody. Um, it's already done and over with. Learn your lesson from it, from whatever it is that's happened or whatever events have gone on. Um, and then move forward. That's the healthy thing to do. Um, and if you have trouble moving forward, you need people around you who you can talk to about it and who you can vent to, who you can release that negative energy to, and who help you um, get that out and get it out of the way so that you can move forward. So those are my thoughts on the subject anyway. So I'm going to continue with my journal pages. I'm going to speed forward through the process and I'll be right back.
I really like this page. Be the light. It says it all, doesn't it? If you do nothing else, you be the positive person, be the light in someone else's life. Encourage them that they can get past it, they can get through it, um, that there's always a lesson to be learned, even if we don't see it right away, and um, it's meant to further our journey. I love the meme that's floating around Facebook right now that I've seen more than once that says, and don't quote me because it says it, I'm sure, a different way, but something along the lines of, um, that I know that the negative people are brought into my life so that I can learn who I don't want to be with me going forward. And that's so, so, so true. So I want you to be the light for someone else, be their positivity, and when you don't have it in your life, figure out how you can change that. Be the light. That's my message today. So that's it for right now. I want to link everybody else's videos for Explorations of Me this month in the description below. So check them out. Show them some love. Um, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe everybody's videos. And if you would like to support the free content here on YouTube and over in the Facebook art groups, or just follow me on social media, you can click on the link tree list of links and you'll find all of the different sites that you can do that in that link. Uh, by clicking on it. There's a whole bunch of things. Um, my happy mail address is also in the video description and a bunch of other things. Don't forget to um, uh, comment of the video if you have any questions, comments, or concerns. I do answer them every single day. And the most important thing, of course, is to go out and have a great day. Do something nice for yourself because you deserve it, and I'll see you later. Bye, guys.